interesting to see some support of this uh, theory, Darwin's and Davis concept. And uh, it has been found that in the Pacific Ocean, listen me, I said that in the Pacific Ocean, these stages of development have been seen like I said that an island is having an atoll and then the, uh, especially over the hotspots, an island is subsiding, there is an a water, there is an fringing reef, then there is an I said that uh, um, uh, barrier reef and then atoll. This kind of things has been found but at the same time in the, the uh, some of the volcanic island which are completely within the ocean and they have uh, some remnants has been found uh, in the below sea level in those remnants along with the volcanic related material and then uh, what is in a corals are also there. So it is supporting the grid, it is uh, completely supporting the theory of what Darwin. But at the same time if you evaluate it little in negative, so it is in a, it has been found that in some of the island it has been found that the growth of uh, one side of the island is fringing reef and other side it is in a growth of I said that barrier reef. So in this way this theory can be criticized then how it is happening, understood? You know that compatible condition is founding and then another side suppose maybe the sea wave, wave is more active, another side the sea wave is less active and then compatible condition, salinity, what kind of salinity is there, sea river water is coming and then uh, it is keep on dissolving. So different uh, conditions which is uh, putting hindrance and some uh, condition putting support that is also one of the issue but even then we can say that this theory can be criticized on the basis of side, one side it is I said. Uh, fringing reef on the other side there is an a what barrier reef and this way there is an a some limitation of the theory and you could write down this support of the theory and limitation of this theory.